Hello ladies and gentlemen, my name is Mings, and I welcome you guys back to Let's Play Advance Wars 2 Black Hole Rising. It's time for the grand finale of the Green Earth campaign. The final battle is at hand. Destroy the pipe to the factory. Lord Hawk, the enemy has finished establishing their field HQ. It has come to this, brought to bear against our own factory. Hawk. Here, Lord Sturm. Explain yourself. The enemy has routed your wretched companions, and here you are, cringing like a dog uh, with its tail between its legs. Protect my factory at any cost. If you fail, you will know no peace and no forgiveness, cur. Yes, my liege. People wanted me to do this. I can't do it as well as Davis. As soon as we're ready, begin attack. Begin the attack on that factory. Think we can handle this on our own? Looks like Black Hole is mustering all of its troops. This war won't end until we destroy that factory. If we don't do this, no one will. That's not exactly true. Commander Kambai! If we pull our mites and fight as one, our chances of victory increases. Isn't that so, Nell? <laughs> yes, it is. We want to help as well. Blue Moon counts on soldiers, but their support is unwavering. I understand. It's not like we've been fighting this war on our own. Together, we stand strong. Now let's go liberate Green Earth! So, a lot of people have been asking me if I can challenge myself a little bit for these few final missions and actually pick the worst CEOs for each map. I actually think that's pretty funny, so let's do that. So we're gonna go with Drake on Green Earth. If you pick him, he'll even tell you at the start of the mission, like, I don't think you should pick me for this. Because, like, air units are insanely good on this map. Um, we're gonna be picking Sami. And then we're gonna be picking Sonya. So we're gonna be going with the worst CEOs possible for these final missions. Let's see if I can still get a good ranking. Alright. Mission 32. Great Sea Battle. So I'll let the intro play, but I have some fun. I have a fun story to tell you guys about this mission. It looks like Green Earth would have an advantage with air units. Yeah, he, he even tells you, like, don't pick me for this. Can I navigate these waters? Only one way to find out. Anchors away. It's funny, though. Like, you'd think Drake be good on a map called Great Sea Battle, but there's just too many naval units and cannons around. That hawk is a little scary. But I won't back down, and I won't lose a land battle. We're closest to the factory. The keys to this battle are taking the cannon and circling behind the enemy. She, she just straight up tells you how to beat this map. So yeah, um, as you can see, the best course of action is to get a rocket over here, and then blast the pipe seam. When I when I beat this map initially on um, on normal mode as a teenager, I thought that this was impossible for some reason. I don't really know why. I, I, I think I miscounted the tiles, and I was like, a rocket won't be able to reach, so you have to get a tank through here. Um, I thought maybe it would be good to get this factory to get a rocket to target the factory or something. So I tried to route Hawk on this map. Um, and I was able to do it on normal mode, but when I arrived on Advanced Campaign... Jesus Christ, I remember struggling so hard to beat this map. Um, I had to like change the batteries in my Game Boy Advance like three times. Because <laughs> I just couldn't beat the map. I just I bashed my head against it so much, uh, and I just couldn't beat it. And Hawk just kept pouring units out of his factory, and I just gave up. I gave up for a very long time. And then I came back to it later, and I was like, okay, I'm gonna try beating this now. And I was like, and I count to the tiles again, I'm like, you know what? You can get a rocket here. So that was kind of funny. But yeah, alright, let's see if we can do this as Drake. This is gonna be interesting. So, uh, one thing I'm gonna do for sure is, um... I am going to grab... This missile very early on. This is very important to do. I'll show you why in a little bit. So I'm gonna go with two infantry here, and we're gonna start capping some properties. I'm tempted to grab a transport copter, but I don't think it's really gonna matter that much. Uh, actually, you know what? I'm gonna get a transport copter. So yeah, um, you got a lot of cannons. You need to take out this cannon. Uh, now, here's a funny, f fun fact about this cannon right here. It's an upwards-facing cannon. As, as you know, the upwards-facing cannons only fire every other day. If they fire on day 13579, I think. Or it was 2468. I actually can't remember. But you can actually exploit this by attacking the cannon when it's firing upwards. So that's something you can keep in mind. Anyway, I'm going to go and grab this missile as well. And of course, we have Sonya here, which is by far the best... Best CEO for this battle, am I right? 
So, uh, there's some units here, but they're stationary. So as long as you stay out of their range, you should be fine. I'm actually contemplating letting Drake have these properties instead of Sonya. But I have to make sure I can afford a rocket when the time comes, so... Uh, I think what I'm gonna do is, um... I'm gonna grab some of the properties, but I'm gonna let, maybe let Drake have two of them, so he can afford building some battleships, because he'll need the money if he's gonna actually, like, build naval units for this. Now, as with all factory missions, this one can vary greatly depending on RNG, because as you probably know by now, every factory unit that comes out gets a random AI assigned to it. And sometimes they can get the guard AI. In fact, I am wondering if this bomber might have the guard AI. Guard AI means it will follow an infantry around and protect it while it's capping, which means that it's pretty much going to be useless. It will attack you if you come within its range. But because the infantry is slow, this means the bomber will be a non-issue for most of the fight. It can also get the passive AI, which means it goes to the HQ, or whatever the HQ is coded to be on the map, and just chills around there. Or it can get the aggressive AI, which means it will just rush towards the nearest enemy unit on the map, which is by far the hardest AI to get. If you get that AI, it's gonna suck to be you. Now, it's very important to utilize these missiles early on, and where I like to pull... Uh, attack is this mech right here. The reason why is this mech is going to go up and start capping the base. And we want to prevent it from doing that because we want this base. If, if Hawk gets this base, he'll start deploying units on that island and it becomes incredibly tough to take it. So uh, anyway, I'm actually going to go and grab these cities right here. And I'm going to go ahead and do this as well. Get rid of this little recon right here. I might still be forced to deploy a few air units as, uh, as Drake, sadly. I don't think there's much I can do about that. But I'm gonna save up my money a little bit. I'm making 8,000. It would be nice if I could get a battleship out early. Uh, the problem is with a battleship is you can get it here and then you have to get it over here, which I think you can do with Drake's movement. And then you can help out taking out the black cannon, which makes it a lot easier for your other friends to advance. But you definitely don't want to spam too many infantry units. Now, Hulk has some units here on hard mode, so you want to be a little bit cautious about that. Uh, he also has a rocket, which is in the way, annoyingly enough. Uh, I'm going to build myself an APC and get myself a mech. And here, I'm going to start capping a few of these properties, but I'm going to be leaving some of them for Drake. Sonya's not really going to be doing a whole lot. I'm still going to build an infantry, though. Could build myself a second lander. That might not actually be such a bad idea. Yeah, you see that? You see what the bombers are doing? They're protecting properties. So they actually both got the guard AI, which is incredibly good for me. So they'll just hang around these properties as they're being captured right now and do nothing, which is fantastic for us. All right, let's uh, cap here. And again, this cannon will fire every day, so there's no escaping that. And we'll run over here and get some of these properties. And if we save up money, maybe we can get get our... I don't know if we should get a cruiser first, or... I think these air, I think these units are stationary, so I don't think they'll move out until you come within their range. So it shouldn't be a problem. But I'll definitely stop building infantry now as Drake and save up for some uh, naval units. I could also let Drake have some of these properties. Because Sami doesn't really need that much. She's just going to be building some mechs, so... However, I am going to take a rocket fire here. In order to delay this guy's capture by another turn. Now he needs four turns to capture this property, which should be enough. Uh, actually, he'll need five turns. So that should be enough. So what I can do now... And uh, this recon is within range, which is a little bit annoying. I think I'm just going to dump off the mech right here. And then we will just continue the mech spam. But yeah, I think I will actually let Drake have a few of these properties as well. I could let, I could let Sami have the airport, but um, it's not like her air units are that much better. They got minus 10% as opposed to Drake's minus. Actually, Drake has got minus 30, doesn't he? Yeah, he has. I, I'm too used to playing Advanced Force by Web Drake. But yeah, Drake's air units are actually garbage. I probably will grab that airport with Sami, now that I think about it. Anyway, um, we're going to go over here. I'm tempted to leave one infantry on the island, but... 
We'll have to see. I wish there was a shoal here, then I could have unloaded my infantry at the same time, but that's probably not gonna happen. Alright, so both those bombers should just stay around, I think. And I do believe the recon will come forward now as well, but that should allow me to take it out with a mech, so... Alright, he's interrupting my cap. That's fine, I s I'll still get it, because I'm Sami. You'll need to reduce the Sami infantry to 2 HP to interrupt a full HP cap, which is incredibly nice. Oh, shit. <laughs> I forgot about that cruiser. <laughs> I forgot. I forgot. Oh, that's funny. <laughs> I'm so stupid. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Ah, that's so douce. Oh my god, I'm so dumb. Oh, wow. That is next level stupidity right there. Next level stupidity right there. Should I get a lander? I don't think I can get... Nah, there's no point. I'll just save up for a battleship. Alright, well, Sonya, I guess you're getting your own properties after all, then. Lovely. This is a train wreck. Jesus Christ. Okay, so we got... Oh, God. Yeah, so the problem right now with using those missiles at the mech is that you can't use them at these units anymore. So Sami's gonna have a little bit of a rough time here. I don't think I've ever tried to do this as Sami, actually. So this is... um. I'm actually contemplating getting myself an artillery here, and yeah, I think I will. This is gonna, this is gonna be tough, I think. It's gonna be very tough. Anyway, we can now uh, unleash one infantry here. Well, that that won't be enough to uh, interrupt, but I'll be able to attack next turn, I guess. Okay, well, that's just lovely. I, yeah, I guess I'll get all of these done. <laughs> oh my god, I can't believe this shit. Yeah. That medium tank is gonna hurt a lot. Luckily, I think this rocket never moves. I think it just stands still and shoots, so. Okay, so those Bottlecopters, I do believe those are regular Bottlecopters, but I don't know what AI they have. We'll fig we'll we'll find out soon, I guess. Ba -da -ba -da, na -na -na. But yeah, he's gonna spend some time capturing those properties. Okay, so moving his artillery forward. In case you don't know, the factory operates on like a 32-day cycle. It has like a 32 set amount of units that it cycles through. And then it stops. Alright, we can get a battleship now. Nice. And then we can start moving up. Grabbing some more properties. God, I can't believe I lost my transporter strike. That is just incredibly embarrassing. Here we go, and uh, I guess he just doesn't really know how to use air units. That's the excuse I'll use. Okay, so I won't attack this medium tank, because I want this mech to stay alive. Okay, so we'll do this. Could build myself another lander and take the island. I think I actually will do that. Okay, so he won't capture this. That's good. And I have two infantry here to interrupt this. I'll, 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 I'll interrupt with one, and then I'll cap with the other. This is a tough mission to get a good ranking on, because Hawk just has so many units, and he keeps building more every turn. With the factory, it's not uncommon for him to like hit the unit cap, so you have to really... Um, you have to really... Oh, God. You have, you have to destroy a lot of units to get a good power ranking here. And this Black Storm also really hurts on this map. But as you can see, he's clumping together most of his units early on, which is one of the reasons why the AI isn't particularly challenging. Alright, so we can go here now. Gotta be careful about the submarine, though. Yes, I can go go with a lander to get my infantry to where they need to be. Okay, so there's a tank here. Um, I don't know if I can lure it out. I'm 
pretty sure I lose an engagement against Hawk on even footing, but I have a mech here. So what I could do is I could try and lure the tank in, maybe? I'm not sure if it's gonna work or not. Alright, let's see if we can do this with Sami. So we finally have our artillery in range with the medium tank, so that's good. It's not gonna do that much, though. We'll see if the mechs can uh, do something else. Let's see. Ooh, I don't know if I want to uh, actually... Uh, I think I want to save my mechs, actually. So I'm going to do... I'm going to do this. And I, I think the artillery will focus on my infantry. I'm not entirely sure. If the artillery can destroy... This I, might actually not be a great idea. I think I might need more artillery now. Yeah, I'll go for the airport of Sami. At the very least, I can get 10% less effective bombers as opposed to 30%. 30% starts to get into the territory where they start to become quite useless. Okay, we can finally grab the space right here. What? Oh no! Sonya's bad luck strikes again! No! Oh, that's actually really bad. Oh no. Uh, it's not really... I guess it's not the end of the world, but it's still kind of annoying, because it means I'll, I'll get the base one turn later. Now, the problem is... Okay, he's actually going for my infantry. That's great. Hawk has some transport copters, and sometimes he might actually start to go for the southern island with those. And now, yeah, so now his bombers are moving to the next property on the map that they want to capture. You see that? So they'll hang around that property until Hawk captures it. But his battlecopters seem to be aggressive, and this is terrible news for me. Because uh, those are actually moving toward. I'm pretty sure they're moving towards my infantry. So this is... I'll need an, in, I'll need an untire on that island now. And now he's moving his transport copters out. And yeah, he's actually going for the southern island. So this is terrible news for me. Uh, I'll need to capture that base ASAP. Okay, battleship incoming. I'll need to deal with this black cannon somehow. And uh, I'll send, yeah, I'll send a lander up here as well. Trying to get the missile would be pretty useful here. But at least the mech successfully baited the tank, which I'm very happy about. I think I might even be able to finish it off. Maybe? Nah. Not quite. If, if that was the Sami mech, I would have been able to do it. Anyway, let's move the APC around here. I think that's outside range of the cannon, right? Yeah, it is. I can start capping the airport next turn, which is very nice. Alright, let's do it. Cap, cap. And I could leave a couple of these properties for Drake. He definitely needs it. Oh, nice. Uh, if I can kill this uh, tank... Oh, I don't know if I can, but... Oh, if I can destroy it, then I can reach the... Oh, this is so annoying. It would have been so nice to attack that artillery with these mechs. But um, I guess it's fine. They'll heal up and get to attack next turn, so... I can also do this. Although it will put my um, mechs in range of his rockets, which is not fantastic. Ah, the good old mech spam. What a great playstyle. Okay, I have to capture this base fast because there are battlecopters incoming. That bad luck of Sonya actually really hurt me. Because as you can see, these battlecopters will be here next turn, so I'll need to build an anti-air. This is very bad. I don't really know why I built another lander. It's not really going to give me that much extra time, but... Okay, I'll save up my money for now. I need an anti-air, and maybe even a battleship of Sonya wouldn't be that terrible. As you can see, he already has... Oh, okay. Alright. I messed up a little bit there. He's going to... Um, he's going to pop his black wave, possibly, this turn, because he's about to get it. Nah, one more star. Okay, this is fine. That artillery is done for. Let's see what his uh, let's see what his battlecopters decide to do. 
I'm actually kind of worried. I know I'll cap the base, but they might completely wipe out my infantry. And transport copters are coming. Oh, okay, no, they're guarding the cruisers. That's interesting. Okay, very, very interesting. The question is, that southern transport copter. Yeah, that's going for the middle island, which is also bad because there's airports there that he can cap, so... So that's definitely not good for me. Um, okay, so that... Oh, there's also... Ah, I need a cruiser now. Yeah, these battlecopters are gonna zone me out now, which is really bad. Okay, this is very annoying. Um, if I go over here... I will be in range of the Black Cannon. But I still need some Umpire to protect my battleship. Because battleships actually do pretty well against... Or, uh, sorry, um... Battlecopters do pretty well against battleships, which is a little bit annoying. So here's a funny little tidbit about Drake. Um, as long as you have, or again, any sea, or really, as long as you have a lander in range of the black cannon, you can cap any property on the island because even a one HP lander is more expensive than a ten HP infantry. So, little funny, funny bit for you there. As long as you have the lander around, the infantry can capture unimpeded. Yeah, I might need to build a Empire Asami actually, or maybe a. Do I need to build missiles? I think I might actually need to build missiles, guys. You'll get to see missile John. Da -da 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 -da. I can't afford missile John. But I need Antire right now. Ooh, or I can. No, I'll build Antire. I have to. I actually have to build Antire. Meanwhile, over at Sonia's place, let's see what we can find out here. 22,000 so far, that's pretty good. Not really gonna be able to do a lot here. Oh, we have a missile though, let's use it for something. Ah, uh, actually, we might not want to pull the Botocopter, that would be very bad. So I think I might just not do that. Alright, so we are on day 8, so... I'm fairly... S I, I don't remember how the... Um, if it's 3, 6, 9, I guess it's, it's a good... A good it's a good time to find out, so... Tomorrow is an odd day? Yeah, tomorrow is an odd day, so we'll, we'll fi figure out if the Black Cannon fires on odds or, or even days now, I guess. Okay. And, okay, now, so it fires on even days. So here comes the Black Wave. So we know now that the, the cannon will only fire on days 2, 4, 6, 8, 9. Or 2, 4, 6, 8, 10. That's how even days work. Overall, I wouldn't say this is a very devastating black wave. It's a little bit annoying. That's pretty much about it. My artillery is going to be ripped, though. I just hope his battlecopter decides to go for my ground units instead of my battleship. Oh, his uh, bombers are running out of fuel. That's pretty funny. Still, though, he's clumping up so many of his units. Imagine okay, that's actually good. That is actually good. I, I like this. Imagine if we applied Carl's AI to this map. That'd be pretty funny. That'd be a challenge, for sure. Okay, so uh, looks like our battleship is fine. Oh god, there's a bomber. God fucking damn it, man. This is so hard. <laughs> this is so freaking hard, man. Ah, this is very annoying. Okay, so... We need to get another cruiser up here now. It's actually really damn challenging. Yeah, I don't know how we're gonna be able to do this. We'll capture these two properties, I guess, and then, uh... Ah, I have to back off with my bomber. I mean, I, I can't... I can't sit around and, and let the... I can't lose a battleship to a bomber. 
spent all this time getting it in, in into position, and now I have to retreat with it. It's a reason they tell you not to go Drake on this map. Oh, not in range, sadly. But, if I pop my double time, I can get rid of the rocket. So I actually think it's worth it. Even though with Victory March would be pretty nice on this map. Uh, I think I might... Oh, if I get a... I don't think I'm gonna get this kill. I'd be very surprised. But I have one more missile that I can pop. Let's pop a Battlecopter. That might actually be useful here. And uh, even though this rocket is almost out of ammo, it's still nice to get rid of it. There we go. And I'm gonna try and trap that Battlecopter so it can't get away. And hopefully it sticks around. That would be nice. Alright, Sonia, I think this entire mission is gonna hinge on you now. <laughs> okay, so we have another missile that we can fire, but again, that will draw the Battlecopter in, so I don't think that's a good idea. Anyway, I'll get the city, which is nice. Um, I need a... Um, Honestly, like, a battleship wouldn't be terrible in this situation. But I would need to capture the harbor first. And I won't be able to move my battleship into range of Hawk's battleship, so I think it's just gonna be a rocket for now. Yeah, I need to destroy the cannon first. It's gonna take some time. It's gonna take three shots, I think, or two shots. I, I think a rocket deals 55% damage to the black cannon. Yeah, so there we go. There, there it fired. Hopefully his... Okay, his bombers are going back for fuel. That's really good, actually. That is very good. Does he even have an airport that he can refuel them at? He might have an APC. Yeah, he has an APC. Okay, now I gotta be careful, because those battlecopters might be in range of my island now. Okay. I can get rid of that Battlecopter. Oh, he's gonna reach the missile. That sucks. Yeah, he's gonna reach the missile next turn. Oh, I wonder where it's gonna... He's probably gonna target it on my battleship. Because that's by far the most cost-effective target. Okay. Let's finish capping here. I'm gonna keep the lander here as well. So now I can move the battleship in, in range of the uh, black cannon again. I'll grab these two. And uh, it's probably time to get rid of this artillery as well. I need to get that missile. I need to make sure I don't put anything near the battleship. So he won't get more effectiveness with that. Uh, 26,000. I think another cruiser might not be such a bad idea. Um, yeah, I think I need another cruiser. I won't be able to deploy anything on this harbor until I shoot down the, uh... Until I shoot down his black cannon. Okay, so at the very least... I'll get rid of his battlecopter now, which is very good. There's another one, though. God, this mission is not easy when you play as suboptimal COs. Holy shit. Um, okay, so I'll get a shot of this guy. I don't know how this will go. Oh, I'm out of ammo. <laughs> yeah, mech was out of ammo, whoops. Let's go. And we'll put the mechs over here. I'm, I wouldn't be surprised if the missile goes over here, actually. That would not be surprising at all. Ooh, let's get rid of the Sunfire. Maybe we'll even get a transport up? I actually don't know if that would help or not. Let's get a transport up. And let's see if we can't pop that missile. Oh god, I put the cruiser right next to my battleship. I'm so stupid. I literally just said I shouldn't do that. And then I went ahead and did that. Oh my god. Ooh, I can combine my landers for money. Hmm. Could try to do that. Anyway, let's grab these, and uh, we gotta move the rocket down here now, so we can start shooting down this thing. 
finish capturing this property. So um, tomorrow will be an will be an odd day, which means that I can actually move up here without getting shot at. I should have actually combined my landers before moving in, because now it's going to get repaired up. What? Oh, okay, never mind. I'm bad at math. Jesus Christ. Oh! Oh! Oh, that's actually kind of annoying. Never mind. So apparently a black cannon will still shoot at an, an infantry, even, even if a 1 HP lander is present. Okay. Wait, how does that even make sense? 1% of, of 12,000 is... How does that even make sense? I, I, please help me understand this. So, a lander is 12,000. So 2% of 12,000. Someone, someone answer this in the comments. I, I, I don't, I don't freaking know, man. Because I would imagine that two HP worth of lander is always going to be worth more than two HP of infantry. Oh, sorry, one HP of lander versus two. Ah, oh, never mind. I, I think I, I think I understand now. Actually, yeah, I think I actually understand now. Anyway, ah, oh, there's a lot of bottlecopters flying around. I'm not a big fan of this. Not a big fan of this at all. Never mind. I, I think I just solved it in my head. Even though I can't explain it, I think I just solved it. Anyway, let's uh, launch a missile. And I think it would probably be a smart idea to include... Ah, there's so many things I'd like to include in this. I think maybe this would be the best. Just take some bite out of the tank and the battlecopter that I can't kill this turn, so the battlecopter don't kill my cruiser. Bum, 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 bum. Yeah, I think so. We could build yet another cruiser. I think that might actually be a good idea, because Hawk has a lot of air units coming. Okay, let's go and grab the base. And, uh, oh god, yeah, okay, no, I did fire the missile, so that's good. Let's get rid of this artillery as well. Okay, and this, this battle quipter also needs to die. Even though it probably means it's the end of our entire... There we go. Really don't want to let him have this pace. That would be pretty bad. A rocket would be pretty good right about now. So I'm gonna see if I can't get some rockets going. Okay. So it will take us about three days, I think, to destroy this black cannon. Yeah, it will. And uh, this is... Okay, so we can't capture the base on this turn. Uh, and now, again, I want to be very cautious here. I think I can fire the missile now without aggroing the battlecopter, so that's... that's good. Okay, let's see if we can find a good target for it. Um, here, possibly, would be good. I, I still think it's it might just be better to do this, though. Because the battlecopter is still sort of a threat. So, yeah, I think I'll do this. There we go. So now those units are completely neutralized. And I have another missile too, which uh, is actually kind of nice. And I can combine these. Uh, I can combine these landers together to get even more money. And as for what I should do here, I'm gonna build an untire just in case, just in case an air unit suddenly decides to attack this island. Oh shit! Okay, all right. No, yeah, no, never mind, never mind, never mind. I did, I did account for this. It was supposed to fire today. It was supposed to fire today. God, the rankings for this mission are going to be painful. Okay, so there's a fighter. Uh, and a bomber that's also in guard mode. Does the AI not know how to resupply? I don't think the AI ever resupplies as a command. I'm not entirely sure if it does or not. Okay, good. The, the Battlecopter is not attacking my cruiser, which is very good for me. It's 
a good thing Hawk plays like an idiot on this map. Oh god, he moved his APC away. His bombers are gonna crash. Hawk, you're an idiot. <laughs> Hawk, you bloody idiot. Your bomber's gonna crash. What the hell? One HP left. If I just had... If I just had one infantry, it could destroy the black cannon right now. Wait, I might be a- Ooh. Sami might be able to pull it off, actually. Yeah, Sami might actually be able to pull it off. Okay, so what about these two? I guess they'll just get shot at, so... Wait, why can't I- Oh, right, 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 right. Of course not, the lander. I'll just use it to shield. Okay, I, I actually can destroy the black cannon today with Sami Santire, if I do this. So that's pretty cool. There we go, and I'll use this IPC just as a shield for the most part. Okay, that's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. Not gonna bother with those uh, submarines because they're just gonna give Hawk free power charge, so there's no point. Okay, let's uh, wave goodbye to the black cannon. And we cannot let Hawk get that base. That would be very problematic. Because he'll start deploying Neo tanks and shit in it. So uh, let's um, interrupt that cap and put the APC on top of the base, maybe, if we can. Actually, I don't think we can, because we need to move the APC away. So, yeah. But that's okay. Interrupting the cap is all I want to do. And then we'll move the Battlecopter into the fray as well. We can afford a rocket right now, which is pretty nice. And we have a transport copter now, which we can use to... Uh, which we can use to transport some mechs onto the front lines, which is also very nice. And yeah, I'll build a bunch of rockets now. As, long as, as well as more mechs. We just need more mechs. Okay, so uh, the cannon just fired, which means it's now safe to go and cap the city. And uh, we will be destroying the cannon in two days, I'm fairly certain. Yeah, there we go. Sonas bad luck doesn't apply to cannons, luckily. So that means we can actually move this into range now. However, oh god, I forgot about this thing. Um, so we'll need to take this thing down now. And yeah, we'll just keep the... Uh, so I can build another artillery. So we have another missile. Let's see where we should fire it. Um, I think maybe here. Yeah, I think this would be a this would probably be a good spot. I think here. Yeah, here. It 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 targets a neo tank and a medium tank. So that's a pretty good missile. There we go. And we can also combine these two together. Oh right, you can't combine together when a unit is ah right. Of course not. Of course not. I should have known. That's okay though. Uh, I'll just accompany you, and I'll, I'll combine them together later. Now, I'm not entirely sure how rankings work in this mission, if I'm going to be honest. I think uh, it might be... Uh, I don't know if it's the CO that destroys the, the pipe that gets the ranking, or if it's just uh, player one. I think it might just be player one. I think it might be Drake that is the only one who gets rankings. <laughs> Stupid Hawk. Forgot to refuel his bombers. Who is he? Olaf? That's hilarious. That is hilarious. Yes, okay, so I'll get this base, which is nice. More mech spam for me. This anti-air is probably dead though. But it destroyed the block cannon, so I'm, I'm okay with that. Alright, here comes a fighter and a bomber. I think that might be in guard AI as well. And yeah, that's a one shot. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. They are definitely worth it, guys. That movement. So good. Yeah, so the battle around this uh, destroyed black cannon is always a bit... Very choky. I remember trying to route this mission as a teenager. It was just a nightmare. I don't know why I insisted on doing it for so long. I, I just, I must have miscounted the tiles and I was just dead sure that a rocket wouldn't be able to reach. Oh, okay. That battlecopter is actually going for Sonya's transports. 
Okay, nice. Oh, right in range of my uh, battleship. Thank you, Hawk. Alright, let's see. So we have two cruisers here. They won't be able to do much for now. So I'll just keep them around, I guess. I can afford another battleship, though, so let's go ahead and do that. The sub uh, lander has one HP left anyway, so it's not like I really care about it. Alright, this battleship is properly protected. <laughs> I guess I can help out here a little bit. Could have also tried to finish off the Neo Tank, but I think it works. There we go, and uh, yeah, let's just put this APC here to shield. We have another city, which is nice. Should probably start building some infantry for my technique ranking. Ooh, okay, I'm not gonna pop double time this time around. I'm gonna save up for a victory march potentially. It could pay off. Okay, so I'll block the base with my APC. I think the medium tank will not have the firepower to kill it completely. So, nah, definitely not. So that's good. Alright, transport is here. And now we'll get, some, we'll get some rockets into range as well. It'd be an interesting challenge to actually try and route Great Sea Battle. Uh, let's get a missile. I think I might be able to do it. A little bit depending on the RNG, maybe. Yeah, I'll keep this anti around to block, if anything else. No, no point in throwing it away. Okay, so we actually have a Bottlecopter chasing our transports. That's kind of funny. Anyway, let's go for some of these uh, bases right here. And, uh, you know, we have another missile. You do get a lot of missiles here, which is kind of nice. I think it might be a good idea to target this. I'll target, I'll target here. Even though these units aren't incredibly dangerous, it's also just nice to get them low so I can finish them off later. And, yep, yeah, let's start. We need three shots to deal with this black cannon, sadly, which is a little bit annoying, but what can you do? At least this one's dead now. And I could put the artillery here to draw the fire of this black cannon to get the base more quickly, which is definitely something I think I'm going to do. And as for this Battlecopter, I guess I'll just build a cruiser? Yeah, I've... Not like Sonya has anything else to spend her money on at this point. Alright, will I get a Black Wave? I doubt it. Nah, he's saving up for his Black Storm now. I completely forgot about this artillery right here. I've just kind of left it <laughs> I left it completely on its own. Alright, more fighters and bombers are coming towards me now. Looks like they're still in guard AI. Oh, what what the hell? What are you... Is going for my HQ? That's kind of weird. What the hell? What are you doing, Hawk? It's kind of kind of strange. I guess he's just trying to base block me or whatnot. Or maybe sometimes aggressive units will also just go beeline straight for, for the HQ and just kind of like hang around there. Uh, oh, he moved his transport into the cruiser. You guys saw that? Here's a fun fact about the AI, though. It doesn't know how to unload them. So once it puts the cruisers, once it puts the tra copters into the cruisers, it's, they're kind of stuck there, which is hilarious. All right, so I'm probably going to get a Black Storm soon. I don't know if there's any point in trying not to. I don't think there's any point in trying to avoid it, if that makes sense. Um... It's probably going to happen regardless of what we try to do. But yeah, I, I'll, I'll start building some infantry just for my technique ranking. I don't. I, it's probably going to be shit anyway, but... Okay, should I try to get the base? I'm going to try to get the base. We'll see if I can make it happen. Let's move the rocket in. Missile Chan needs to get in on the action as well. We can afford another one, so let's do that. Could have built it on the other base. Might have been better, actually. Okay, uh, Bottlecopter. Uh, should you interrupt the cap? I don't think so. I don't think that will be needed. 
Okay. One more shot to get rid of that. And we have the base. I guess I'll send the other rocket in. I can combine it with this rocket to get a full HP rocket. Might not be such a bad thing. So let's do that. Ba -ba 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 -ba. I don't really know what I'm going to do with these two infantry. Probably not a whole lot. I wonder, if I put a cruiser in range... Will Hawk... <laughs> will Hawk attack it? I would be very surprised if he did. Alright, no Blackstorm yet, I think. I don't think there's any point in trying to delay it. I think it's gonna happen regardless. I, I don't know, I could try to not kill his units. And see if maybe I can get away with it. It'd be certainly be kind of nice if, if I didn't get a Black Storm. But I think at this point it's kind of inevitable. Yeah, I got a bunch of cruisers that can take out his bomber and shit, so... I think that might not be such a bad idea. I I'll combine my rockets anyway, so... It shouldn't really be a big deal. Bop, bop, bop. Okay, he moved his infantry into a lander now. I wonder what he's gonna do with that. He's gonna move back to his base. Okay, not gonna go for the island. Alright. So, yeah, I think it's probably just time to attack now. Yeah, let's just let's just attack. Let's We need to get rid of this bomber. God, I wish Drake had more firepower on his ships. Of course, that bomber is going to be a 5 HP bomber next turn. I guess I could just pop I mean, like he's going to pop his black storm anyway to heal up damage. So maybe I'll just do a fuel drain on him. I don't know. I could also wait until after he's popped his black storm. I think probably that's a better thing to do. Just pop it afterwards. Ba -ba. No, no, no. Yeah, I think I think I'll just wait with it. I'll pop it afterwards. Ba -bum, bum, 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 bum. Let's. <laughs> I don't even know what I'm doing anymore. This mission is stupid. Oh, uh, what a stupid mission! All right, I'll get the uh, I'll get the base, which is very nice. Hell, I'll even combine two infantry together here and take a shot with my rocket. This might be a kill if I get good luck. Yay! We're pushing him back. Saw me OP! There we go. And hell, why don't we... Why don't we have some more fun here? I don't really think this entire will be able to do much, so I'll just move it forward. Maybe I can trick the bomber into attacking it, that'd be kind of cool. Got it. I wish I got ranking Sasami. That'd be pretty cool. Because that means I would have been able to... Uh, I probably would have gotten a very good technique ranking considering how many infantry I've spanned. But no, it's going to be Drake. It's going to be Drake who gets the rankings. Alright, Sonya. Time to kill the Black Cannon, I guess. Uh, maybe I should wait combining the, the rockets together until after the Black Storm. I don't know. There we go, it is dead. Yeah, I'll combine them together after the next Black Storm. In fact, I could just build another rocket. I don't think it's gonna really matter though. No, it's not really gonna matter. Yeah. Yeah. It's gonna get his Black Storm anyway. Ah, what's the point? There is no point. Let's build a sub. <laughs> I mean, yeah, he's gonna get it, 100%, so... I could wait until after Drake pops his Typhoon, and then I could go in and one-shot the thing. I could also just move in with my Cruiser in such a way... Oh, I know what I can do. I can attack fr with the Cruiser from a different location, so that I won't get attacked by the battleship. That's a pretty smart idea. Let's do that. Alright, here he comes! Black Storm! To be defeated is to lose everything. Are you prepared for that outcome? Yeah, I am. Ba 
Such a good power. I've definitely been underestimating Hawk in competitive. I've gone up against Hawk players a couple times now in tournament matches, and uh, yeah, he's he's actually pretty damn good. Uh, I I don't know why I ever called him bad. Global map damage and 10% constant firepower. He's he's actually pretty disgusting. Um, I I have no idea why I thought he wasn't. Global map damage is just so strong, and when combined with a strong day-to-day -day power, I mean, 10% firepower, it's not the end of the world, but as a constant day-to-day -day on every single unit, it is pretty damn good. Oh god, what is he doing? He's sending his fighters towards me? I guess they're in aggressive mode. So he just moves them towards the nearest unit, even though there's no air units on the actual island. That's kind of funny. Oh god, hi. I love the little glitch when the bomber only drops two bombs. They kind of, like, vanish midair. I don't know why they do that. Oh, wait. I hope the rain won't screw over Sonya this turn. I, I It shouldn't. But uh, I, hope it, I hope it won't. Yeah, he always cleans house during Blackstorm. Very annoying. I also believe he gets more aggressive during Blackstorm. I think most of his units will attack. This is just a theory I have, but I'm not... Oh, hi there. Oh, whoops. <laughs> I'm so stupid. I don't deserve a good ranking for this one. I still don't have my Typhoon? Are you shitting me? All right, well, let's fix that. I guess I didn't really lose that many units this turn, so it kind of makes sense, but still. Uh, there we go. That's better. Anchors away! All right, let's watch the fuel icons. This is a pretty nice power to pop on this mission. Oh, it's gonna be so many fuel icons now, guys. Look at all those fuel icons. Oh, yeah. That's what I'm talking about. All the fuel icons. Wow, that didn't do anything. <laughs> that didn't do... Didn't do shit. That didn't... Didn't do shit. That, that... Didn't do shit. That didn't do shit. Oh, you can actually combine them together. It won't hurt your technique score. Bye, submarine. You've sh you've sunk your last lander. So, sadly, you don't get power ranking for uh, enemy units who crash us due to fuel consumption loss. That uh, That would be pretty cool, but... Sadly, that is not treated as a kill. I'm just, I'm just envisioning a bunch of 6 HP infantry shooting on a black cannon. Like, err, die! <laughs> the ricochet should kill them, I think. Alright. There we go. And let's combine these two together. Uh, let's just get an Antire here. Missile Chan will be... She's already in range. Okay, good to know. God, yeah, the rain actually makes it really hard for my uh, my rockets to move. Makes sense. I mean, look look at how much tires have to pay to move through forests in rain. Four movement cost. Missiles literally cannot move. They literally cannot move. Okay, so right this turn we're going to be combining our rockets together, and I do believe that should be enough. So if we do this, we should be able to win in two turns, unless something drastic happens. And yeah, I mean, let's, let's just do this, I guess. Actually, the Battlecopter is going to destroy this cruiser now. But unless it goes into fuel mode and goes back, that could actually happen. 
But yeah, it doesn't really matter what we do here. We'll win in two turns anyway. Unless Hawk suddenly decides to send a bunch of air units towards our island, but we have Empire for that. So it's not like it's going to be a big deal. But yeah, overall, I will say, as epic as I still haven't killed a Scottam artillery. As epic as Great Sea Battle is, like, narrative-wise, gameplay-wise, I do feel like it falls kind of short. Like, it just doesn't really, um... Yeah, all of his units are, are going to crash now. I don't know, I just, I feel like it, it the, the concept, oh my god, he's actually loaded a Botocopter into a cruiser, that's hilarious. It fails on a, it fails solely due to the AI, I would say. It's, um, I, I, I like what they did, like the design of the map is great and whatnot, but due to the way the AI plays, it just doesn't really, it's not a fun map to play. I wish it was. I think it's because the, 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 the way this map is structured, by the fact that you have to go and, and, and blast open the pipe from the southern island. Um, it just... It's like, you'll win anyway. If you know what I mean. It's not like Hawk can really... Like, it's not like he really attempts to stop you. Especially not if you use missiles to take out the, miss, the, the mech on the island capturing. So... What the other player, or the, it, it pretty much just comes down to Yellow Comet. Slowly walking up, moving a rocket over. And then eventually winning. It feels like what you do in the, uh, at the top doesn't really matter, which I don't think it's a, it's, it's a great thing. Bum, 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 bum. I wish that each... It would be more fun if each player had a very crucial mission to play. You know, if, if all players actually needed to work together to make this happen. I think if Hawk went harder on the island, and the other two players were forced to, to do more to distract him... Like, if you don't distract him, he'll send a bunch of units to the island. So you have to keep the pressure up to, to keep him occupied. I think that was what they were going for initially. But just due to the way the AI works, it doesn't work out that way. Bum, 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 ba -bum, ba -bum, ba -bum. Okay, so let's begin shooting the first volley, and yeah, 55%, so... No matter what happens- oh god, I just- <laughs> I didn't mean to do that! <laughs> oh, I didn't actually mean to do that, that's <laughs> kind of funny. <laughs> oh, so many oopsies today. I am oopsie mangs today. Bow, 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 bow. My sub is dead. <laughs> Sonia, you idiot! You didn't. Oh, okay, right. Okay, that actually scared the shit out of me because I was like, oh my god, yeah. He gets ambush rockets, uh, but luckily they're not in range of my rockets, so. Still, though, that's the thing that can happen. Like, ambush rockets out of a factory, that's pretty BS. Now, fun fact, if you hack Hawk to be playable, if you actually, like, play Hawk on this mission, you will not get factory units. Uh, not in any factory, because, uh, according to Cardle, um, the factory units actually spawn on a, on a special face that is not available to the player. So, if you if you hack yourself to be playable as Hawk, the, the factory will just do nothing. You will not. So, if I were to, like, try and reenact this as, like, a PvP scenario with four players, if I were to play as Hawk, I would not get the factory units, which would probably make this mission impossible for me. I, I, I think without the factory, it's almost impossible to win this as Hawk. And with the factory, it would probably be impossible for the humans to beat this, I would imagine. Although, it would be fun, funny to try and reenact a factory battle of some kind. Maybe normal mode? I don't know. But again, without the factory, it would just be impossible. Alright, there we go. I think that's all the units we can build. I don't think there's any point in attacking, because we're going to win anyway. Yeah. I mean, there's no point. We're going to win now anyway. and it won't, it won't affect our ranking, so... Okay. Father, Sensei, citizens of Yellow Comet, lend me your strength. Who would ever pick Sonya for this mission? 
Like, who? Okay, I would, but... There we go. Is this the end? Commander? What are your orders, sir? Do as you please. Um, a new commander? You're not planning on going down with the factory. Fool! This place may be important, but I have no desire to die with it. Now go! If you want to save your skin, you must do it yourself. Yes, sir. Farewell, sir. Ha! This is one situation I never expected myself to be in. I survived, though. And where there's life, there's opportunity. The factory is captured. And the enemy CO? Missing in action, sir. He disappeared at the time the factory was secured. Really? Nice work, soldier. Thank you, ma'am. It's over at last. Hmm. Peace will now return to Green Earth. Phew! That was nice. Huh? That was unexpected. Hmm? What was? Nice? I thought you'd be more excited. Oh, I'm thrilled. I just want to take a nap, is all. Oh, I'm bushed. <laughs> Congratulations on your victory. As your ally, we are very happy. We couldn't have done it without your assistance. Actually, kind of could. On behalf of the people of Green Earth, I thank you. Hearing that makes the journey worthwhile. Yes, it does. Now, Commander Eagle, I think you grasp the situation, but... Yes, the war is not yet finished. Correct. You know where that pipe leads. Until we've defeated Black Hole on their own turf, the war will never truly be finished. It sounds like things are just going to continue getting tougher. It's not like the, it's not like the combat we've seen up to now has been child's play. No matter who the foe may be, we won't lose. Alright, let's get ready for the worst rankings ever. Gah! <laughs> 27 power. Oof! We did it! Green Earth is free! Oh, yeah, I guess Dro Drake is the one who gets the victory quote. Yeah, and even though Sonya was the one who won the battle, technically. Alright! Ladies and gentlemen. We got two missions left. Let me know in the comment section who you like to who you would like to see me play as against Sturm in the two final missions. My name is Minx, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye bye.